Still haven't seen those movies. <laughs> we, should, we should totally get together and watch them. I haven't seen Ten Forge. I, I, I bet yeah. you anything when it happens. Oh, that's the worst superhero film, actually. <laughs> Never mind, I take it back. It's really that bad? Yeah, it's, it's the worst. Justice League is better than that movie. Hmm. Everything I didn't even in think Fantastic Justice League... Four is I didn't unearned. think Justice League was that bad. Yeah, me neither. I thought it was okay when I saw it. I still think I do. Ah, <laughs> oh, damn it! <laughs> I mean, I already talked about that one scene when they defeat Doom, and then they come back to Earth through the portal, and then there's like, da 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 like heroic music that's fucking unearned. Is it? Yeah, I hate it. That you part of the movie pissed me off so much. We should, uh, I bet you anything, if we have a movie night with uh, Fantastic Four, the original ones, uh, when Chris Evans shows up, he's gonna be like, oh. <laughs> Well, your muscle's Captain yeah, America. I <laughs> yeah, I know he is. I can't believe we got sandwiched! That was the worst way to die! We literally got sandwiched, my guy. Once again. Oh, on the contrary, I was, we were watching Spider-Man 2 yesterday for lunch, and uh, it's still a good film. I like it. It's one of the best superhero films um, I've Last night I also found a review of, like, Spider-Man, the Sam Raimi trilogy, worse than you remember. It was kind of just an exaggeration, but, uh, yeah, I don't know. It's, it's like, they're Wait, not, like, the massive uh, Spider-Man, Sam Raimi trilogy, worse than you remember. But he said so in the beginning of the video that, he doesn't think they're the worst films. Like, they might be a little less great than what we thought. And even though it's been, like, years since he watched it, I still watch it because I just, I just love them. And I think they're so Well, great. I really just like the movie overall because I, I know the plot holes in Spider-Man 2. Like, Doc Ock being able to take all those hits and fall down a whole building while rolling down without any sort of power <laughs> besides the, uh, the arms. It's a giant, like, plot hole if you really think about it, Yeah, but... yeah, like, I, I, I try to come up with excuses for it, how, like, the metal arms on his back are protecting him. I don't... Yeah, but I don't think so, man. Yeah. Like, him falling but... from that building to the train, <laughs> he still would have died. Yeah, he should have, he should have gotten Even Spider-Man, he, 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 he fell on... Oh, wait, that's right, he fell on Spider-Man. Yeah, but, I don't know, I, but... Honestly, that movie's just so good that you have to forgive it. Mm -hmm. I was kind of curious. Oh my like, god. I mean, I realized this just now when I was watching the movie. Hey, let's go lucky. <laughs> yeah. Like, he dropped Aunt May's, like, Flutterfingers, and I'm like, what? Is he, like, evil now? Like, completely? And I'm like, oh, the arms are controlling him. What? They were, right? Yeah, yeah. So it's like, that's why he was, like, being mean. <laughs> he did drop Aunt May. Um, people praise Spider-Man 2 for being like the best game ever, superhero game ever, but uh, it still is, but it has a lot of flaws, especially with the voice acting. Tobey Maguire does, a, does an okay job, a little better than okay. Um, Alfred Molina, who voices Doc Ock from the movie, and in the, in the game, he came back. He does a shitty job. Every single line he says is like, my Rosie's dead. It's up to you, Spider-Man. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna kill you. Even though he's, he's supposed feel to be like, like really angry. The, I feel like... Yeah, but I feel like just the simple fact that they, that they're, uh, just the simple fact that they got, that they did the movie, like, it's an accomplishment, I mean, that they did the game is an accomplishment yeah, in and of yeah, itself. Yeah. A lot of people came back for their games, uh, um, what's it called? Robert Downey Jr. came back for Iron Man 1, the game. What? And that's it, he didn't come back for the, for the other one. I don't uh, think he would. <laughs> no, he didn't. 
uh, Chris Hemsworth, I'm pretty sure, came back on tour of the game. And I think Chris Evans came back for the game, too. That's before they knew how big they were going to be. Now they're just, now they're just like, no, let's take it to that. No, because they, they stopped making superhero movie games. Well, yeah, so but I think if Marvel good. wanted to make more, I don't think the actors would have done them. No, yeah. It's kind of cool Toby came back for all three, though. It is pretty cool. I think that regardless if it's good acting or not, the fact that it's Tobey Maguire mm -hmm. voicing Spider-Man, like that's pretty cool. Um, in the first Fantastic Four game, all the voice actors came back. Did Next, they? Yeah, but not for the second one. <laughs> Remember they were gonna have... They were gonna have Chris Evans audition for the X-Force as a human torch. That would have been so funny, at least that would have happened. That would have been hilarious. Somebody Here, made a me. point how Tom Holland's Spider-Man basically is crime fighting from Plasma to Stark. I, uh, but, okay, here's the thing. I don't think he is because he was crime fighting before uh, he even met Tony. Yeah, yeah, but then it's like, it, it, it's really weird. It made it a goal to impress Tony and, like, he's still crime fighting because it's good. He has to, it's a responsibility, but, I don't know, it's something they don't really, ex they didn't really explore in, um, what's it called, uh, Homecoming. In the very end, you can still say, like, oh, he's, like, gonna do this by himself to impress Tony, but it's, like, it's also doing it because it's right. He can't let Vulture take this plane and uh, sell illegal weapons. I really like the whole mentor thing that they have going. I just don't like it when people say that, they say if Tony was to die in Avengers 4, that they were gonna make him the Uncle Ben of the MCG. Like, I, I don't want that. I want actual yeah. Uncle Ben. Yeah. I like that episode of Ultimate Spider-Man where um, uh, it was a Doctor Strange team-up episode and Peter saw Uncle Ben. I think I remember that. Yeah, that was a nice episode. Except it had Peter's okay, so shitty voice actor. <laughs> Actually, no, Derek Bell's a good voice actor. I just didn't like it. His delivery in that line. Uncle Ben! It's really you? I'm so sorry. Yeah, I mean, I just, I get that. Uncle Ben has been done twice in live action, but I want him back. I want to see the MCU version of him. Mm -hmm. I miss Spider-Man, the, the new animated series. Yeah, I, I don't. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't like it? Uh, I didn't really watch it that much. I yeah. miss Spectacular Spider-Man. It's my That's favorite. What I, miss. I like, well, actually, if it were up to me, to bring back a Spider-Man show, I'd say spectacular. Even though I would really want uh, the new animated series, because I don't want to be selfish and like take that away from people. But I feel like, just in general, that if you bring back Spectacular, that they have more plans for a storyline than for future storylines to like make compelling. It's, it's, it's so weird how every time a show gets canceled, it's right on the cliffhanger. Yeah. Uh oh, Spider-Man's gonna die. Uh, what do we do? Cancel it. Uh oh, Spider-Man quit being Spider-Man. What are you gonna do? Cancel it. Uh oh, Norman Osborn's alive and he's blonde now. What are we gonna do? Cancel it. Well, the thing is that they they always make shows leave off in a cliffhanger so they could get a new season. That's how they get people to watch the new the new season or whatever. But since uh, what's it called? Since it got canceled, it can't get resolved, mm -hmm. which is depressing. But uh, that one show I was talking, uh, I was watching for a bit with uh, David Trimmer, uh, Feed the Beast. It ends up in a cliffhanger where the restaurant blows up and David Trimmer and his friend and his son are still in there. And but, oh, it. dude, look at this. The last we saw of it. Yeah, let's get the chest. Two chests. Oh, f dude, we just been fucking about <laughs> and, like, just told people left. Here, uh, get the chest. Oh, ah! not enough wood. Uh oh, no, no, no. Wait, 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 wait. Oh man, there goes my rifle. I'm going back for my rifle. 
Here. Come on, I gotta get back up. Uh oh. Is that you? Where? Shit. How did I miss that guy? Oh well, well. Where are you? Right here with you. Oh, Someone just shit. tried to shoot at you. Yep. I see him. Oh. He's right here. 60 east. 60, 60 northeast. Keep your head down. I hit him. The guy's building a little fort right over there, right? Yeah. They're running. Here, when don't go. When it's time, we'll take the warp. Okay. Oh, we'll take it like towards here. Damn, just like that, I'm back to 800 wood. Let's go. Uh, hold up, not yet. You see that up there? 30. That fort? Yeah. Yeah. Maybe we should launch pad up there and attack them. Alright. <laughs> Sure about this? No, but uh, it's our best choice. L remember, land on top. Yeah. But not yet. When the circle starts closing. All right, this is it. This is a big moment, man. Do you have any uh, shotgun bullets? Uh, oh fuck, we have no. Here. Thanks, Let's go. Ah! Ah. Oh man. Got him. I knocked one. And I'm landing. Oh, I missed. No. Oh, I killed him, I think. Fall killed him! Yeah, 100, 100, go down. Ah, almost got him! Oh, he had a lot of health. I killed one guy. Yeah, what was he using? I don't know. Oh, man. Damn, could have gotten him. It's a 1v1v1. Are you gonna watch? Oh, are you watching it? I already left. <laughs> Damn it. How did you die so fast? He just he just got me. Uh, he started sh like laying it all to me. All right, this is gonna be my last game, man. All right. Take it to Mexico. <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> that that was my favorite round. We literally.